the road to Tampa. We just got back from Orlando last night, and today I booked my first acting job. My character actually has a name, and as you can see here, I got my surfboard. I am a surfer slash rescuer. I'm not really sure how much I can say, so I'm not going to tell you a whole lot more about it than that, but I'm pretty stoked about... Get that stoked, surfer? Yeah. I'm pretty stoked about... Uh, about booking my first acting role. It's pretty exciting. Holy smokes, it's early, guys. Good morning. 3.35 in the morning. I am just leaving Orlando, making my way to Indian Rocks Beach for the uh, shoot today. And it is still raining outside. Check the weather yesterday. It was supposed to clear up overnight and get cold. And it didn't do either down here in Orlando. It, uh, it's only about 55 degrees. It's a little chilly. It's not too bad. It was supposed to be in the 30s. Um, and not raining, but it's pouring down rain, 55 degrees. So this is going to be really interesting getting in the Gulf of Mexico <laughs> with it pouring down rain and fancy camera equipment. So we'll have to see how it goes. It's going to be an interesting day. You can probably tell I'm, I'm fighting a little bit of a cold. So that's probably not the best thing to go play around in the ocean with a cold in the cold but hey it's all part of the adventure right beautiful sunrise coming up over Indian Shores Beach or Indian Rocks Beach we are actually changing locations so we are heading south towards St. Pete Beach and Fort DeSoto Park and um, had to change locations because the Gulf of Mexico is just too rough for shooting today so we are heading to Fort DeSoto, which is kind of on the, um, it's not really the intercoastal, but it's the inlet, I guess is what you call it, but it's, you know, it's inshore, so it's blocked by the, this barrier island here on the west coast that we're driving down right now. So, we have a quick change of locations and hopefully get started soon with, with the uh, shoot. Looks like they have some flooding out here at the beach. All right, we are in St. Pete Beach and we are coming up to the Don Cesar. This is kind of a icon of St. Pete Beach. It's a very high-end, very nice hotel right on St. Pete Beach. Stayed there a couple times and uh, actually been to a wedding there once. But uh, that, that's the old Don right there. Big, pink, and ugly, but it's a very nice hotel. There's a better view of the Sunshine Skyway Bridge. State Park. Real pretty area here. Lots of walking trails. Well, this big flagpole was one of our markers about how to get here from the film crew. We're heading towards East Beach. And the water looks amazing. It's like glass. It was rough as could be out of the Gulf of Mexico, but the water here is just glassy as can be. It's amazing how different it is. It's not windy here at all, but the temperature is definitely lower than it was at the beach. Here's East Beach. This is where we're headed for today. East Beach. Looks like I'm the first one here. Maybe it is a little windy. Didn't seem like it in the truck. It's definitely cold, holy moly. The ground's real wet. Real pretty park though. Location today, Fort Soto Park. I'm not gonna show them filming. I'm not sure I can. Pretty nice location though. So we're finally getting ready to do one of my scenes, so I'm heading out, getting ready to get in the water. I'm going to be freezing! A little seagull came to visit us, just sitting there, that log blocked the wind. A 
market, oh blood. Fake blood. A little setup they got for our water shots. Well, I'm done with my shoot and on my way to the hotel. Uh, of course, I'm coming back tomorrow. But oh my gosh, today was a huge challenge. Uh, I think I was in more shots than anybody else and in the water more than anybody else with just my swim trunks on. The water temperature was 58 degrees and the air temperature was 55 degrees. So, and the wind was blowing. So you can get an idea of just how cold I am right now. In fact, I've been in the truck for about 15 minutes and the heat's been on the whole time and I'm still cold. I, I still can't feel my to toes. I apparently can't talk very well either. Um, Oh, it was, it was a long day. It was rough. But it was fun, and I'm going to be on a TV show. Uh, one of the featured characters in this episode, so that's pretty darn cool. But I'm just going to head back to the hotel, get a nice hot shower. Uh, I need to do like a little laundry in the sink, actually. Just kind of get my swimsuits cleaned up and dried for tomorrow. And go to bed, because I am exhausted.